The achievements of our comprehensive campaign complete an important chapter for Utah State University and mark the start of a new and exciting period for the university. Nothing has been or ever will be the same since the campaign began. Already it is changing lives. The campaign has created nearly 200 new scholarships that are impacting students every day. As a recipient of the Huntsman Scholarship, doors have been open and opportunities have been afforded me that I otherwise never could have had. I was able to come to what I would qualify as one of the best business colleges in our nation. And thanks to the generosity of those donors who are willing to invest in my future, it's made all the difference in my opportunities up here. Uh, money isn't the only way that I can give back now because I'm afforded more time thanks to the generosity of others' money that gets me through school. So I've been able to participate as a director in Special Olympics and I've been able to go when we studied abroad in South America, we participated in microfinancing to help people out there and just look forward to now giving my all to make a positive impact on my community, on my nation and on our world. Beginning with Old Maine more than a century ago, Utah State University rose from a sage-covered bench because of people willing to invest in its future, even when their own future seemed less secure. Mother and dad both, in the early days in my growing up years, they didn't have much money, but they would give to things that they thought were important. We have witnessed that same resolve over the past decade when, despite grim economic conditions, people still found ways to give. The campaign has made possible the construction or addition of 24 major facilities, including the Bingham Entrepreneurship Energy Research Center in Vernal, the Swanner Eco Center in Park City, and the Emma Eccles Jones Early Childhood Education and Research Center. Like Old Main, these structures stand today as new beacons on the hill and across the state. Funding from the capital campaign and specifically the Emma Eccles Jones Foundation and the Dolores Dory Eccles Foundation provided not only the building but also provided endowed professorships which enabled us to attract people here that saw what was happening and wanted to be a part of this team. And we have people working together in an interdisciplinary way to develop better ways of educating children, better ways of diagnosing learning disabilities, and we think can have a real impact on how children learn and develop and behave. Private support enhances a university's ability to fulfill its mission of education, research, and service to the community. It allows for the development of top-notch facilities that will attract uh, quality faculty which enhances the learning opportunity of students. Beyond bricks and mortar, the campaign paved the way for 234 new endowments, including five chairs, seven fellowships, and three professorships. Excellence in the performance of music depends on the collaboration between great artists and great music. And so it is in education. It is a collaboration between an excellent faculty and a community dedicated to excellence in all things. A great example of this collaboration is the university's Beverly Taylor Sorensen Endowed Chair for Arts Education for Children. It reflects Beverly Taylor Sorensen's passion for arts education. And where would our university, our community, and our state be without the magnificent Manon Kane Russell and Catherine Kane Wanless Performance Hall? It is without doubt one of the great performance halls in the nation. I'm just really grateful that we were able to further some of the things that we think are important. It was bold and sure thinking that informed the makings of this university and it is daring dreaming that sustains it. John M. Huntsman had a vision for a school that would transform business education. And now, every day, the innovative Huntsman School of Business is re-engineering the student experience. We now have four named colleges and schools, the Huntsman School, the Kane College of the Arts, the Emma Eccles Jones College of Education and Human Services, and the newly named S.J. and Jesse E. Quinney College of Natural Resources. If you don't have the bricks and mortar to build the facility, then you don't have the space 
to bring those expert people to teach and students to come to to learn. We've also tried to provide scholarships for the undergraduates, the graduates and the faculty and all of that goes together to produce excellence and that in turn gets passed on and encourages more and more. The campaign for Utah State University has always been about shaping and changing lives. To help us accomplish that, thousands of friends and supporters reach deeply into their pockets. We are grateful to every one of the 53,000 people who participated at every level. When I think of the hundreds and thousands of alumni and students and boosters that have given over the years to make the athletic program stronger, it just makes us all real proud to know that the great success they're having right now, both on the field, facility-wise, and in the classroom, it's all a large part due to this uh, great campaign. We look forward to the future with uh, great optimism. By every measure and benchmark, we achieved our goal and a new level of excellence. But we know, in truth, this is not really the end of a campaign. It is the beginning of a new future. We are just getting started when you consider all that is to come as a result of all that was given.